These materials are lightweight, strong, and resistant to a wide range of corrosive environments. FRP composites have a wide range of potential applications, from infrastructure and construction to aerospace and automotive. For example, FRP composites can be used to create corrosion-resistant reinforcement for concrete structures, or for lightweight and durable components in aircraft and automobiles. Another example of a corrosion-resistant composite material is ceramic matrix composites, CMCS. CMCS are made up of a ceramic matrix, such as silicon carbide or alumina, reinforced with fibers, such as carbon or ceramic. These materials are lightweight, strong, and resistant to high temperatures and corrosive environments. CMCS have a wide range of potential applications, from aerospace and energy to biomedical engineering. For example, CMCS can be used to create lightweight and durable components for gas turbines, or for biomedical implants that are resistant to corrosion. However, there are also challenges associated with the production of corrosion-resistant composite materials. One of the major challenges is the need for materials that are both effective and cost-effective. Many composite materials are currently expensive to produce, making them difficult to scale up for widespread use. Another challenge is the need for materials that are durable and long-lasting. Many composite materials are subject to degradation over time, which can reduce their effectiveness in corrosive environments. Another technology for producing corrosion-resistant materials is the use of nanotechnology. Nanotechnology involves the manipulation of materials at the nanoscale, which can result in materials with unique properties, including corrosion resistance. One example of a nanotechnology-based corrosion-resistant material is graphene. Graphene is a two-dimensional material made up of carbon atoms arranged in a hexagonal lattice. Graphene has many unique properties, including high strength, flexibility, and electrical conductivity, as well as high resistance to corrosion. Graphene has a wide range of potential applications, from electronics and energy to biomedical engineering. For example, graphene can be used to create corrosion-resistant coatings for metals, or for electrodes in energy storage devices. Another example of a nanotechnology-based corrosion-resistant material is titanium dioxide nanoparticles. Titanium dioxide is a white powder that is commonly used as a pigment in paints and coatings. When used in nanoscale form, titanium dioxide nanoparticles can form a protective layer on metal surfaces, preventing corrosion from occurring. Titanium dioxide nanoparticles have a wide range of potential applications, from coatings and paints to water treatment and biomedical engineering. For example, titanium dioxide nanoparticles can be used to create corrosion-resistant coatings for buildings and infrastructure, or for water filtration membranes that are resistant to corrosion. However, there are also challenges associated with the production of nanotechnology-based corrosion-resistant materials. One of the major challenges is the need for precise and complex manufacturing processes to create these materials. This requires advances in material science, engineering, and nanotechnology. Another challenge is the need for a deep understanding of the properties and behavior of these materials.